butter goes off, you lift out the fries and then add salt. Oh, man. Mr. Malazzi? Hey, um, can we talk for a minute? Of course, young man. I'm a guidance counselor, and I'm here to guide and counsel. <laughs> Good one. Like that. Like what? Give your joke. What joke? Never mind. Anyway, uh, I've been thinking about college, and I... Thinking? Good. Aristotle said, thinking is important. Or was that Plato? <laughs> well, he was my next-door neighbor, Mitch. No, no, it was, it was Aristotle. <laughs> well, hope that helps. Drop by any time. <laughs> Excuse me, M Mr. Malazzi. Look, see, I'm not sure if college is right for me. Oh, the great teenage dilemma. College. From the Latin collegium, which means college. <laughs> Some people call it university. Uh, the English, for example. Like my cousin Emmett and his darling wife, Victoria. Mr. Malazzi? Who live in this charming hamlet in the North Country. Mr. Malazzi, look, I I'm trying to decide if I should go to college or if I should go to art school. Or maybe if I should just start trying to make it as an artist. Hmm. Well, let's uh, consider your options. Okay. You could go to college, hmm? Or not go to college. You could go to art school, huh? <laughs> or not go to art school. Funny, you know who wanted to go to art school? My niece, Rhonda. But then she joined the Peace Corps and moved to Pakistan. Ooh, Pakistan. Pakistan is a primarily Islamic country that's a butt to India. Or is that Turkey? No, no, it's India. <laughs> Hi, Mags. Hi. Uh, yeah, I like your outfit today. You know what I meant to ask you? Well, if a car is accelerating at 30 feet per second and the stop sign is half a mile away, would you give it up already? <sighs> Fine. Uh, which of the following is not a palindrome? A rotor. Oh, please. B nexus. You're out of your mind. But I'm the one who's supposed to have gotten 1,500. Look, I don't even care about Princeton, OK? Princeton? Yeah. Well, some admissions officer saw my score and uh, wants me to apply. <laughs> Princeton is, is recruiting you. Well, you think I want to go? It's in New Jersey. <laughs> hey, what's uh, going on here? Miss Roberts here can't handle someone being smarter than her. Smarter than she. You're using the comparative. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Pretty soon I'll be using my fist. Uh, all right, time out. OK, Emily, I know you've never faced a feat like this before, but Mags did better on the SATs. Live with it. Go, Chris. And as for you, Mags, darling, you be sensitive to Emily. I mean, there's no need to be so, uh, splenetic. Splenetic? I mean, uh, 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 fractious. Chris, what's going on? Well, I thought it might be nice to communicate on your level. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh! There's no need to be so choleric, darling, all right? <laughs> Hey, Pop. Hi. I ordered dinner from Yang Chow. It should be here any minute. I thought you cooked. I did. Thanks. <laughs> Listen, something's bugging me. What? You can't figure out why Darth Vader let himself be seduced by the dark side? Huh? <laughs> no. No, Dad. Something bigger. What's up? Oh, I'm trying to figure out this whole college thing. Oh, that's understandable. I mean, college kind of represents the first major crossroads of your life. Yes, and it's kind of overwhelming. <laughs> yeah, I remember. Everything about it seems so important. Right? Exactly. Like, like, these decisions are going to affect my whole life. Oh, which is why I want you to know that every decision you make is going to be yours. Really? Yeah. All right, all right. Thanks, Dad. Now, take State University. They may have more resources, but private whoa, whoa, university... Whoa. What are we talking about? College. State versus university. Oh, okay, because I'm talking about college going versus not going. <laughs> not going? <laughs> not going. Right. No, seriously, look, I, I want to be Ronald, an artist Cody, and... You're going to college. What happened to the it's your decision guy? 
Well, yeah, it's your decision on which college you want to go to, but whether or not you're going to go? You've already decided for me. Cody, listen to me. Why do you think I work so hard? I mean, why do you think I keep the camera store open even on Sundays when I don't have to? It's to save money so that I can send my son, you, to get a college education. Well, what if I don't want to go? Cody, read my lips. You're going to college. End of discussion. At least it was my decision. Cody? What's up? Hey, hey, Romeo, can I uh, ask your opinion on something? Always happy to share my wisdom with the citizens of the world. Right. Um, have you thought about what you're going to do after high school? Oh, yeah. I take an approach I call endpoint planning. Meaning? Well, I start with the endpoint I want to reach, then I work my way backwards. Makes sense. What's your endpoint? Six-time MVP for the Lakers. Low expectations. I like that. And endorsement deals. You know, shoes, chocolate bars, denture cream. Right, right. Denture cream? For the elderly. You gotta hit all the demographics, man. I got you. Okay, so what? College, Final Four, chain of restaurants? And don't forget the gig on ESPN. Because you know they love an MVP with a smile. <laughs> yeah, if I want to be a cartoonist, what's my end point? Look, you exactly? be whatever you want to be. But whatever you pick, make sure you get the merchandise rights. Dear Sally, I wish I could tell you more meaninglessly stupid details about my self-important college existence, but I'm too busy playing the felicitatious home game. Just roll the dice and... Oh, look! Invite a homeless person to your prom. I like my life, but I love this game. Okay, so when did you definitely know you wanted to go to college? That's easy. I've always known. Well, there's never any doubts? No. Nope. Well, there was that one week in second grade when I was pretty sure I wanted to join the circus. But then I would have gone to clown college. <laughs> I'm kidding, Cody. I knew that. Look, I, I know it's true. I've sort of always known I was going to go to college. It's just one of the pieces of the puzzle that helps me get what I want. And what do you want? A law school, I think, but I'm keeping my options open. Mm -hmm. That's the great thing about college, finding out what you want to do. So you think I should go? I didn't say that. You think I shouldn't go? I didn't say that either. You're saying I should join the circus. You'll figure this out, Cody, and when you do, you'll know it's right. And, uh... Hmm? Just so you know, I think you're an incredible artist. Thanks, Sam. Just so you know, I think you would have been a great clown. When Queen Hoffa for the defense, Your Honor. And Emily Roberts for the prosecution. <laughs> okay, so you already know where you're going. Yes, I'm heading to Stanford. No, oh, they happen to have a great arts program. Really? Although, Stanford does have rather high admission standards. But I may know a way I can get you in. First, Victor. all you have to do is get your father to inherit $12 million. Then, when he donates a building, get him to name it after a relative with a fancy name like um, Hannibal or Cornelius. Victor! Victor! Why are you going? Excuse me? Well, you seem to have all the details about where you're going to go to college worked out. I was just wondering if you ever stopped to ask yourself why you want to go. Well, that's easy, my friend, when it's a stipulation of your trust fund. The why becomes rather inconsequential, n'est-ce pas? 